Welcome back to the channel friends. Today we are making a vegetarian curry. Start by slicing two medium sized onions into juliennes. Next you're going to slice your tomatoes into large chunks and set them to the side. In a large pot over medium heat add two tablespoons of oil and your onions and begin the caramelization process. Stir your onions occasionally, scraping up all the fawn or brown bits at the bottom. Once your onions are caramelized, add five cloves of garlic and all of your spices and begin to saute for one to two minutes or until your spices begin to release all of their fragrances. Add your chunks of tomatoes to your caramelized onions, cover with a lid, and let stew for 10 minutes. Once your tomatoes and onions are done stewing, add a quarter cup of water, then add your mixture to a blender and blend into a smooth paste. We only need one cup of our base. Save the rest for another use. Finally, on to the curry. Start by slicing one pound of Yukon Gold potatoes into bite-sized chunks and set them to the side. Next, cut the ends off your squash, then quarter and cut those quarters into bite-sized pieces. I forgot to film this part, but julienne one large white onion and saute over medium high heat with two tablespoons of oil. After two minutes, add your potatoes and saute for another minute. Add your spice mixture and saute until fragrant. Add your stock and then let this come up to a boil. Once you've come to a boil, Add two 16 ounce cans of coconut milk, one cup of your curry base, mix together, and then let cook uncovered for 45 minutes to an hour. After 45 minutes, add one can of green beans, your squash, and cook for an additional five minutes. After five minutes, remove your curry from the burner. To serve, scoop some rice into a bowl, ladle in some of your curry, and then garnish with dukkha and cilantro. Thank you for watching this video guys, that's it for me. Leave a like, comment, don't forget to subscribe, and always, stay cooking.